Good day and welcome to this week's tech tip with the e-learning team. Today we address the question, why and how would you change the availability of an assignment? Kelly? Yes, in this era in which we live where there's COVID and medical issues and flu and all kinds of things going on, there are some times that your student will request to have their time for their assessment changed. If they're in surgery or they're home with COVID, they are not able to be there at the, at the set date and time, especially for an online course. So there are medical and illness reasons, and there's also disability reasons. So you may get contacted through the student that has their information from the disability center. There's a lot of different disabilities that will need to extend time on assignments or make changes to the assignments. Um, and actually Tracy had some more ideas on that. Thanks Kelly. Yeah, those are definitely some good points about the students either, again, the medical or disability. My reasons that I've heard a lot of other people need in what, as well involve just the cost of technology. One thing that students who may not have the best, latest and greatest technology, and they may be attending some of their class on their phone, but they have access to computers through the library, through our academic literacy center, local libraries. So some of those students request to have the time of the test change when they can get an appointment. So essentially, they can have their own proctored test setting and not need to upgrade and buy more expensive technology, you know, especially if they only have a few more months till they graduate or if it's just for those tests using lockdown browser. So by allowing them some flexibility to make an appointment with someone with higher level of technology, they can save money and still participate and be right on top of things. Dan, I think you were gonna share the specifics of how easy it is for the faculty member to do this for students. That's right, it's quite easy. Now we're referring to a specific part of the assignment editing options. Um, this will be found in the options for any assignment, discussion or quiz. Uh, and we're talking about changing the range of, of the availability. Um, in most cases, you're not going to wanna change what is already there, the original instance, but if you have a student with one of these situations, uh, go right down to the bottom to the add button and create a new set of fields for yourself where you can enter the information specifically for that student's needs. Uh, you also might run into situations where you can, uh, where it would be helpful to do this for different student groups within a course or among different sections that you might have cross-listed where they're all working on the same assignment. Be sure to enter all the details for each uh, instance and be sure to hit save when you're done. Thanks so much for joining us for this week's Tech Tip.